Welcome to this Windows channel and this is a look at another feature in the April 2018 Windows 10 update uh, within the uh, Windows Defender Protection or the uh, Windows um, Defender Security Center. So in the section for virus and threat protection, one of the things that is there is something that's uh, basically um, called virus and threat protection settings but in there there's something called controlled folder access once again this is something that we tried didn't you know I wasn't sure it didn't work properly or was kind of complicated we're gonna try it again here so man manage controlled folder access what is controlled folder access so if I turn this on it will now modify some of the settings because what's happening is that this now turns on protection in the different folders in your computer so by default the protected folders are the ones that are on your PC which is the uh, documents the pictures the videos the music and the desktop also your favorites now this means that when this is activated you actually uh, will need to give apps permission to write or change anything in these folders. Now I had tried this a few times and I kind of was going a little nuts on this option. I am going to try it again with the April 2018 update and see how it goes. Technically this is a great feature because if you get for example ransomware it technically can't access these folders to encrypt for example because it doesn't have permission you can also add a protected folder so by clicking that add button here you can actually go and choose a folder that you wish to actually protect that is out of the ones that are here so for example you might have a specific folder with you know some important documents you can add it to the uh, folders that are protected so uh, we'll try that and uh, we'll actually get back with my report of what I think about it uh, in the coming few uh, days and weeks and we'll be taking a look at you know how we can actually stay safe on our computers so uh, control folder access a great way to technically you know um, be safe with ransomware you know uh, if you do actually get infected and uh, we'll see how it works and uh, I have a little more details in the coming days. If you uh, enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.